She called him Felix, which meant lucky to her. He was a middle distance runner. She didn't take him seriously, but shifted in her seat when he walked by. He thought her plain, but sensual in some way. Licked the corner of her mouth thoughtfully. Wore her skirts above the knee. She told him a story about a pair of green and gold yarn gloves that she'd been given. It was with a sting of recognition he realized she'd given those gloves to him. When she left, it had the feel of a little tradition. So last solitude to the wind, but when you leave again, leave something of you with them. Tie your fishing lines to fence posts and do your best to reel them in. The candle flickers, you measure morals by unsturdy things. Tear these off of the sycamore, pin down the butterfly's wing. I never knew it got this cold in August here in Tucson. Lonely in the evening, there's nothing here to hold the heat. The sun goes down, it floats off and is lost. Anyway, you got a jacket, tell me where you got that necklace. He looked across the parking lot at the path under the highway. At the mouth of it, a man swung back his hands across his back. He coughed and he turned back to the table. He told her a story about a hand and brought a pillow that he'd been given. It was with a sting of recognition she realized she'd given him that pillow. When he left, it had the feel of a little tradition. So last solitude to the wind, but when you leave again, leave something of you with them. Tie your fishing lines to fence posts and do your best to reel them in. The candle flickers, you measure morals by unsturdy things. Tear these off of the sycamore, pin down the butterfly's wing. Tear these off of the sycamore, pin down the butterfly's wing. Tear these off of the sycamore, pin down the butterfly's wing. And.